Hello, this is Tony Hiller from Visitech.ai. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can use Visitech to collect information about North American EV charging stations. The data I'll be using in this video is from the Department of Energy. A link to this data is included in the video description. In order to do this analysis, we're going to go to a website I helped develop, Visitech.ai. This is what the website currently looks like for subscribers. There will be some changes to the look and feel in the not too distant future. The first step is to click on the Options tab. Then click on Demos and select Alternative Fuels. It will take a couple minutes for the data to load, but when it's done, the screen will look like this. What you're seeing on the right is a Google map of the more than 92,000 stations in North America. You can click on the Table tab to see the types of information which are available from the Department of Energy. They're providing a lot of data and you can see the different types by scrolling horizontally. Now let's start analyzing the data. I'm going to click on the microphone button and issue a voice command. Group by state and count the number of lines. Now we have a graph showing the number of charging stations in each state and I want to rank them. Rank Series. If we hover over the graph we can see that the most charging stations are located in California. In second place is New York, followed by Quebec and Ontario. Let's do the same exercise for cities. Group by city and count the number of stations. Rank Series. Los Angeles has the most stations, followed by Montreal, San Diego, and Toronto. Now let's look at all the stations in a specific city. Boulder, Colorado. On the right side of the screen, we now have a map showing the 208 electric vehicle charging stations in Boulder. This is a Google map and we can zoom in on it and take a closer look at some of these stations. Let's use Google Street View to take a look at these ones right here. If you're planning a trip with your EV, this tool could be invaluable to people who want to know exactly where to look for EV charging stations. Now let's go back to the Table tab and do a different type of search. Group by Facility Type and count the number of lines. Rank Series. The most common type of facility is marked as zero, which means they don't have any information about it. So I'm going to X that out. Now we can see that the most common locations for EV charging stations are convenience stores, hotels, gas stations, and car dealerships. Let's say we're looking for a hotel with an EV charging station in Missouri. Let's click on the Table tab. Now click on Facility Type Hotel. Next we're going to click on State MO for Missouri and hit the Send button. If we want to find a hotel in Springfield, Missouri, which has EV charging, we can just zoom in on this and find one in the part of the city which we're looking for. Let's take a look at the Tesla chargers on Gladstone Avenue. You can see that they're on the wall of the Fairfield Hotel. They also have a charger at the Doubletree Hotel. Let's find out the details of that charging station by double clicking on the yellow circle. Now we can see all the detailed information which the Department of Energy provides about that charger, including things like the phone number and times of day when it's operable. There are a lot of different types of queries which we could do, but I'm just going to show you one more in this video. I'm going to click on the Table tab. And I'm going to issue one more command. Group by EV network and count the number of lines.
rank series. You can see that the vast majority of EV charging stations belong to the ChargePoint network. As I mentioned earlier, you can work with a very wide variety of data at Visitech. The EV charging stations are just one use case, which we've provided as an example. We will be making lots more instructional videos soon.